Today, we'll show you seven shooting situations and give you seven ways to score more goals in real games. Also, we want to give a big thank you to the band Manic Drive for letting us use this banging track. Reverse shots to the near post. When players are around the edge of the penalty area and they cut inside to shoot, it's probably most common for them to shoot for the far corner. But sometimes the goalkeeper is cheating that direction. And shooting to the far corner will just make the save easier. This is why, if you can, you should look up and have a glance at the goalkeeper's position before you shoot. And if you see them cheating, it's probably best to act like you're going to go to the far side, then go to the near post instead. Shoot over the goalkeeper's leg. When an attacker is facing a goalkeeper in a 1v1, probably the most common way to score is to simply pass the ball to the side of the keeper. Sometimes though, goalkeepers will stretch out a leg, specifically to block this type of shot. That's why, when you're sliding the ball past the keeper, it's often a good idea to put the ball a little off the ground. This will help you avoid the goalkeeper's leg, but also keep the ball low enough that they won't be able to block it with an outstretched arm. If you watch closely, You'll notice that a lot of top players do this in 1v1s. Use the pace of the cross. When a cross is coming into the box with a lot of speed, it's often better to simply redirect the ball into the goal. As opposed to swinging at it really hard. What you need to realize is, when a ball has a lot of pace, you don't really need to add any more onto it, especially if you're pretty close to goal. So in these situations, it may be easier to simply angle your foot so that the ball will deflect off of it and into the net. The near post smash. When you're shooting from a tight angle, near the corner of the six yard box, it's probably most common to shoot across the goal to the far corner. And most of the time this works, if you take a good shot. But because the far post shot is so common, it means that sometimes the goalkeeper will anticipate it. And in these situations, it may be better to smash the ball to the near post. The key to this shot is power. Obviously you need accuracy too, but the only way you're going to squeeze the ball in at the near post is if you hit the ball so hard with so much speed that the goalkeeper literally can't react fast enough. And the only way to do that is to use the power shot technique. Follow up shots. When an attacker takes a shot on goal, there's always a chance the ball will bounce back into a dangerous area. 
the goalkeeper could make a mistake. The ball could bounce off the post. Or the goalkeeper could make a good save, but still only manage to push the ball into the path of an attacker. So if you're someone that wants to score a lot of goals, you always have to assume that the ball is going to come back to you. Assume that the ball is going to be dropped. Assume that the save is going to come to you. Even if you don't think it will. If you do that consistently, you're pretty much guaranteed to get yourself some easy goals. Lean over the ball. It's never a good idea to lean back while shooting. When you lean back, your foot will naturally swing upward on your follow through, sending your shot well over the crossbar. When shooting, you should lean forward so that your head is over the top of the ball. This will help you keep the ball low and get more power on your shots. Shoot through defender's legs. When you're shooting, oftentimes a defender will reach out a leg to try and block your shot. One way to beat the defender is to look like you're going to shoot to one corner. Then, when they move to block your shot, shoot the ball through their legs toward the other corner. Shooting through defender's legs gives you another way to get a shot on goal and makes it difficult for goalkeepers to see the incoming shot. If you watch a lot of high level football, you'll see this type of shot all the time. And eventually you'll start to realize all those shots through the legs, they're no accident, usually. All right, everybody, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and make sure to check out the rest of our videos if you want to learn more about football.